Now we're going to be doing a pumpkin tonight, y'all. Pumpkin. These are from um, Hobby Lobby. So, oh, let me show you this one. It does have a little, like a little jute, um, like a little jute um, bow on it. But I, I tore this one off because we're going to be doing something different. So I'm using this one tonight. I think though what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and paint the back of it. This will work. I'm going to use the paint pixie, this latte color. We've got that color going on, and I'm, it, it looks finished and pretty too. Because I'm going to get into these grooves here. Um, I'm gonna try to keep this intact. I hope I don't rip it, but. Okay, so I'm just gonna straight cut this. I'm not gonna worry about fussy cutting it. With um, vintage retail therapy. So I got this paper from Mira. Oh, upside down. Um, so I've had this a little bit, a little while. Not sure if this should work. You just use whatever you like. I'm gonna use my decorator's varnish. Okay, let me, we're gonna trim this off. You know, not, not too bad. Not, not too, too bad. Isn't that pretty? I love that paper. We're gonna go ahead and seal it. Okay, y'all, look. How pretty is that? Let's do a little diamond dusting on this. I'm gonna put some right here on this big flower. Yeah, I love it. Now we're just going to embellish this. Now, um, I don't know, I may, I'm not sure about putting a tag on it or not, but I got some of this ribbon from, of course, good old Hobby Lobby, but y'all, I couldn't pass it up for, that says 62 cents. So my Hobby Lobby has all these ribbons on sale for hardly nothing and, um, this ribbon is kind of a, it's kind of a, like a velvet type, I don't know. Anyway, they had a ton of these different colors, and I used this. I just made two little bows and put them together here and made me kind of a little embellishment. So, I just have a few picks. I got these from a from some picks that I had, some fall picks, and then my little, my little ribbons right there, and then just some raffia. So I just kind of put all, all this stuff together, and I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that right there. And look, I just used one of these, I don't even know what that is. I just found them in my stash, put them all together. And we are going to, I'm just going to glue that right on that stem. That may not stay. I may have to do something different. Alright, 
so I'm gonna put this right here now that is um, I did tone it down a little bit with this um, gold wax paste from Pent Art just kind of the edges so you can do whatever you want to these pieces to make it your own I'm not taking the sparkle off of it but um, I just use the Pen Art Antique Paste is all I do. I'll fix all that and take pictures, but I'm not cooperating. Okay, so here we go. I think I'm going to just tone it down just a bit, but I like it. So there's our, you know, one of our pins of the month that we got in our pack. So y'all, y'all can use those in your crafts. You can use them, you can wear them, collect them, whatever, whatever you want to do. But yeah, that's a chunky little piece right here. And like I said, I got these from the Hobby Lobby. So I'm going to probably do this one too. But yeah, they come in different sizes. I think they come in three different sizes. So... How pretty is that? So that is a decoupage queen rice paper. This uh, surface is from Hobby Lobby. And that is one of our pins of the month in that frenzy pack. Totally Dazzled sells sparkling rhinestone wedding supplies. Check us out at totallydazzled.com. But before you do, click up here and download our free printable sparkle quotes. Or click down here and watch one of our other awesome tutorials.